and Jenna. So I, I'm like, I like to, when I just when I describe it to people who love the original show, I'm like, she's a combo, you know? Yeah. She's a casual. Um, yeah. But yeah, I certainly didn't want to copy any of the original performances. I really love both of your characters in this show. Mallory, I'll start with you. Karen immediately appears as a sort of mean girl, we could say. Um, what was it like for you to take on that kind of character? Oh, just so great. I love every every little bit of meanness. That I, every opportunity to be awful is, it's such a great joy as an actor. <laughs> to be like, why, what is motivating this behavior? And so any mean girl, I'm like, it, it's fun to dive into that and and to try and understand and empathize, like, well, where is this actually coming from? And, and Karen is such a beautifully flawed character and we do get to go and see what her home life is like and, and sort of try to understand why she's like this. But yeah, I, I, I always feel weird saying it, but any opportunity at any moment with the liars where I'm just supposed to be so <laughs> awful is like, it's such, it's such a great joy to do. Cause you feel like you don't get to do it in real life. So you feel a little naughty. I, I, I love playing Karen so much. I love her as a character. And obviously right off the bat, we learned that Aaron is a ballet dancer. So Zaria, do you have a background in that? Or did you do any preparation for that aspect of your role? There was a lot of preparation that went in. I, I danced a lot throughout my life, but it, it's never been consistent. So it, I wouldn't I wouldn't put the crown of dancer on my head, but I would say that we had like eight hour dance rehearsals that it was like, great, pause for a drink of water. <laughs> and Kelly Devine taught us. And it was really, really, really beautiful to be able to step into those point shoes and and be what I think is so beautiful, which is an artist and an athlete combined into one. Which cast member do you both think is most like their character in real life? Hmm. Well, definitely not this one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're the most <laughs> unlike your character, the most like their character. I want to say Maya. Maya's quite like her character, yes. Maya is very funny in yeah. real life, very like kind of, I don't want to call her crass. That's not the word, but she's, she, you know, she's. Yeah, she says what she thinks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. to the point. Yeah. She reminds me of Noah. Yeah. I and think also like true. just so sweet too at the same yeah. time. Yeah. You know who's a, a lot like his character as well? Um, ben Cook, who plays Henry in 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 the best ways. Um, I mean, we they're were... both great dancers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. In that way, in that he's, he's um, protective and a great friend. So I think, I think those two people. Yeah. Yeah. Now, I'm also curious, did either of you take any inspiration from the original Pretty Little Liars series in your portrayal of your characters in this new chapter? I mean, how could I not? You know, you try. I I, I, I didn't want, well, I, you know, I, I would hope to be as similar to Allison. I certainly did not want to try and emulate emulate, replicate her performance because no one could ever. And, you know, Sasha Peters is such a genius, but I did have hopes that, you know, you can't help but be like, okay, this is the, this is the mean girl. Although I do think, um, I like to say, I think Karen's kind of a combo of Mona and Allison. Oh, yeah. And I recently heard uh, a little bit of Melissa too. Um, and Jenna. So I, I'm like, I like to, when I just when I describe it to people who love the original show, I'm like, she's a combo, you know, yeah. she's a casual. Um, yeah. But yeah, I certainly didn't want to copy any of the original performances. I think for Farron, um, I just wanted to be really protective of her story. And um, I was really excited to step into the same universe and also to represent something that, um, you know, I am excited to see in in this world, which is a, a black ballerina. So it's. Yeah, it's it's really it's really inspiring to be able to see their performances and then have uh, a story that you know builds on that foundation. Yeah, I love that. And finally, keeping it spoiler free, how would you both like to see your characters in this series evolve? Should there be a second season? I yeah, I'm like I have trouble answering that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Spoiling, 
I <laughs> you go. <laughs> <laughs> well, to avoid spoilers, I think that you know Farron is also dealing with chronic illness, and she is struggling with the idea of being seen, whether it's being seen by her mother, being seen by the ballet world, being seen because she has you know an uh, a pain that people don't see just by looking at her. Um, so I think that I would love for her to feel seen because I think that would open her eyes to be able to see other people like. Um, Karen, Kel Karen, and Kelly, who are who are people who have hurt her in the past. All right. Well, thank you both so much for chatting today. Congrats on this show, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. 